do 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 what's up guys we are playing um some feed the beast infinity and guess what we're gonna be covering witchery today you can see right now i got a witch's hand i do not know what this does yet but we're gonna find out in this uh in the next couple episodes so we'll go ahead get that out of here and first things first we need to go ahead and make a witch's oven so if we go over witches oven we're gonna need to go get some iron and some iron bars so i'm gonna go ahead and go grab some iron right there we're back we finally got our iron and let's go ahead and see what our crafting recipe we need two iron thing you need to get yours whoa whoa not not that much 16 iron bars that's plenty so then we go like a little helmet and two so helmet dun dun which is oven go ahead I hope it's safe in this wood area. Let's go ahead and throw that down. Oh, that's cute. And then we're going to need to make some clay jars. There we go. Uh, clay. Lots of clay. There's colored clay now because of both handy. Here we go. Soft clay jar. We need to make this first. So we're going to go put our clay together like that. And then we put it in our oven and we get clay jars. So I've got the clay on me, but I'm going to need to go get some cobble. And some coal, maybe. So let's go ahead and go get some of that real quick. I think I've covered this already. Yeah, I've already covered this. This is the axe. It's great. Or not the axe. This is the hammer. Hammer. There we go. And uh, it covers a huge area of mining. So as you can see there, super quick. And we get 3x3 three three radius for when we hit it. And now we have 26 cobblestone. Screw diorite. Get out of here. And let's dig ourselves a little bit out of here. Copper. Yeah, we could probably use that later. Not in Witchery, though, as far as I'm concerned. So, Witchery, guys, is a mod that it's not completely, like, crazy in the fact, like, Thomcraft shooting spells and stuff like that. However, you get some really cool potions. You can summon demons and all that kind of stuff. So, we need to go ahead and make a Tharnaus. And... Bloop that down. Coal. And what we're going to do, we need to shove some clay in there. Nope, wrong, wrong idea. We need to do this. Let's just start with eight of them right now. Bam, so that's going to take not too long, but we'll get our eight jars in a moment. By the way, guys, while we're waiting for this, we can actually go ahead and make a witch's cauldron. That's what I'm looking at right now, so we can go witch's oven. But it says, oh, never mind, back. There we go, there's the cauldron. So that's a little weird. I don't know. Is there even a crafting recipe for this? How do we make the cauldron? Alright guys, our clay jars are finally done. And then next up, we are going to need to go do something pretty cool here. You guys remember mandrakes? Maybe, maybe not. Some of you guys, maybe you've seen Harry Potter, and uh, they have mandrakes. And those are those screaming little plant things. So I don't know if we right-click it or we go for it, but I know they scream, and they run around, and I think they have a muffler, which... Mandrake... Yeah, whoop, whoop, because I hit my two on my mouse. But anyway, earmuffs, leather, wool. I don't know if we got that kind of stuff right now. Let's just, let's see if we can deal with it. Oh, no. Whoa, whoa, what the heck? Oh, what? Kill. What the, what's this effect? Nausea. Oh, God, we can't deal with this. Oh, my God. Um, let's get another one. Let's be sure to kill it as soon as it pops. No, 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 no. Oh, my goodness. What in the heck? Alright, so that's something. That's something interesting. Let's go ahead and plant these guys back down. Ugh. Ugh. The effect's so real, it's making me sick in real life. Anyway, guys, now that that's gone, we can, uh... What do we do with those guys after? We, we have to make a cauldron, which some of you guys might be like, What? How do you make a cauldron? Because if you have been playing this mod pack yourself, usually when you click it, it gives you the... Uh, recipe for it, but instead we're actually gonna have to make a normal cauldron and that requires That so we'll place this down and then we need something called anointing paste so Right there this requires snowball seeds water choke Bella and mandrake. I got these three, but I need to get snowball seeds so got Belladonna Potato seeds we don't got need that mandrake and water artichoke Nope, wrong one. Go over here. I think it can be placed in any order. Not too sure, but I'm going to go ahead and go 
knock down a whole bunch of plants and stuff and see if I get some snowball seeds. All right, guys, a wee while later, we finally got them after we destroyed a whole bunch of plants around here. We just wiped out a lot of the grass. And uh, we'll go ahead back in here. I believe we need a light source. That would probably be a good thing to do. So we'll go ahead and take half that. Where are they? Got too many seeds to take care of now. Artichoke and Waterbella. So now we have anointing paste. I'm going to go ahead right click that. Some magical stuff happens. And now we have a cauldron. And to do this now, we're going to make Montandis. The only way to do this is lighting with fire. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And show me some magic. I think that's boiling. I think so. Let's go ahead with what we were doing before. And is it boiling yet? I think we throw that oh perfect there we go one egg if I got the egg in get in there what are you doing eh? go boom did it happen did it happen what's going on here stuff's happening there we go we got Montandis and it just used up all our water all right guys so the reason we actually made Montandus is because it's used to acquire things such as Rowan, Rowan Hawthorn or Alder saplings because we cannot grow a Rowan tree without it unless we find one. So we can find a plant and turn it into a rose poppy, back into a fern, spruce sapling, Rowan sapling. There we go. That's the one we want. Um, I think I got a bone. Yeah. Let's go ahead and see if we can get this to work. Perfect. All right, guys. Now that we've got our rowan tree up, we're gonna go ahead and cut it down with this axe. And let's see. We can get rowan saplings and rowan wood and stuff like this is good for all the potion makings. The next step into this is making an altar. So an altar. We need altar blocks, and that is going to be. So we need our rowan wood, water, and breath of goddess, and the horned one. All right, guys. Here we go. Make our stone bricks. Ah. Uh, Double it up a little bit. There we go. That looks good to me. And then what it, we needed was... What was it? We need... Breath of Goddess. We already got the horned one, which is done by burning saplings. So we might need some more saplings to go do stuff like that. But what's the other one? We need... God... Goddess. And that's burning birch saplings. So this is pretty easy so far. We just need tree saplings. So let's go ahead and get some of that before it turns night. Beautiful. Now we have four of each sapling here. And let's go back to the water cauldron thingy. Alright, we had to go out and get some more saplings, so let's see if this is going to work now. This would be the fifth sapling it's getting through, so there we go, finally. There we go, so that's going to give us three, so we need to do this one more time, actually. And let's build the altar. And I think we're going to have to move this to a bit of a... Whoa, 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 whoa. At least he didn't affect anyone. Or the farm, at least. Uh, let's move this out into the middle of the yard. I hate you, zombie. So we'll go ahead with this. Like so, it's going to be a 2x3 red carpet appears. Or that's more or less a red cloth. And then from here on, we got to activate the altar by right clicking on it. We'll bring up a screen showing you how much power the altar has collected. So we'll wait for that to refill, guys. We're going to wait for this. Whoa, 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 they're everywhere. Holy. Zombies, you need to chill. So it's got to double that yet. So let's go back. And let's make one more thing. Alright guys, what's next that we need to make? We're going to make a distillery. So this is going to require two clay jars, gold, and a tune stone. Now we need a lava bucket, diamond, and a whiff of magic. Whiff of magic we get from rowan saplings. Now what we need to do is get the diamond, a lava block. I have the diamonds over here. Let's go ahead. One I use. I got the bucket on me, I believe. We'll go get some lava. Guys, please let me know if you uh, like this episode or even uh, subscribing because that would mean a lot to me. Because I enjoy making these videos for you guys and it's really fun. So, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. okay, that was close. All right, guys, here we are. We're going to finally make this go right there. Diamond and a whiff of magic. There we go. We finally got our tombstone distillery. Now we need gold ingots, which I should have got in my house. So I'll be right back. Play pots and bang, bang. There we go, we got a distillery. Now, I don't know if there's any crazy specifications, but let's pop it down right there for you now. That looks pretty cool, actually. So, we can go ahead and shove some clay jars under there, I believe. That's what it wants. No. That is where we put it, though, just judging by that. So, distillery, we can do some real cool stuff with. 
like, let's see. I think you can make like any of the potions here, so let's make a pretty cool one right now. Nope, potion. These are all the normal Minecraft ones. Thomic Tinker, Blood Alchemy, Potion Flask. Ah. Witchery. Are they called brews? Is that is that what they are? Brew, there we go. So that's a nice way of differentiating them. So brew of endless water. That's pretty cool, except it looks like it has durability, so it's not really that endless, is it? Combustion. Pretty cool. Brew of bats. Hollow tears. Is there an easier one to make around here? Brew of vines. Webs. So this requires dandelion. Dense web. So this is in a kettle. Alright guys, so we got what we need for the kettle. And the recipe goes as such. So, something like this. And... Boom. So there we go, there's the kettle. Hey guys, thanks for watching. God damn it! Okay, anyways, thank you for watching this video. Please leave a like or subscribe, and that means a lot to me. Thanks guys, see ya.